Hi there, it's Saeed. In this tutorial, I will teach you how to make this kind of video animations. Watch the video till the end so you can make yours. Let's get started. The first step is going to insert. Click on animation. This is the speed with which we want the camera to move. So let's make it 20. Okay. And then we can go to this animation tab here. In this timeline, we can add. So let's first see the location of the camera. It's there. I mean, this is this is actually the starting point of our animation. Let's go in this direction and click on this plus. Go forward again, plus. Turn around a little bit like this, and then plus. So let's go back to see how does all that look. So this is the trajectory of our camera. Let's go in this direction, then plus. Let's go like that, another plus. And here, another plus. Let's take a look at the final trajectory. Well, the animation starts here, goes all the way, following actually this line here. Now, this is the Akema interpolation. We actually have three of them, and the interpolation here means the way the camera takes between every two points. So if we make it linear, it would look like this. So there would be like um, a hard turn in every point here. But if we want to make it smooth, we can either choose cubic or akima. Depends on every case. In my case here, both are okay. So I'll just leave it like this, akima. And in the left side, so these, I mean, information here, we can find them in the animation. If we click on it, go to the bottom parameters. So these parameters are exactly the same as these ones. The frame per second, we can leave it like this. The duration, this is the, this is the duration of our animation. We can change it, make it 20, for example. And once everything is okay, then we can go to render the animation like that. The output type is actually the type of um, project you want to, either uncalculated, which means exactly like this, the project with no lights on. But if you want the project with the lights on, you can expand this and select luminance distribution. And the output, this is the format, AVI is actually for the video, JPEG and PMP are for a series of um, images, but leave it AVI. If you want more options, you can click here and then choose the one you need. But I will cancel this and go back. The resolution, you have a lot of templates here. You can choose any one you want, but you can also select manually and then, for example, in my case, 1280, 720. The duration, you can set this manually from this to that, but let's go to complete animation and then I press start. We choose the location of the movie and then save. And here we have a little preview, you can hide that. You can open after the calculation, I mean the video. You can also uncheck that if you don't want to open it after. But let's open it after the calculation is finished. Here is the final animation.
you can go and do the same thing by choosing the path you want the animation to take, add as many points as you need, and then render your animations. That's it for this video. See you in the next one.